Hi and welcome in another video and this time I will show you the difference uh, after cleaning uh, GPU and as you can see I have a Gigabyte uh, 1070 Ti here which uh, was heavily used uh, for about one year and I will do three tests. First will be just like uh, like it is. Then I will clean the dust, which uh, maybe you can see. I will show you in a close up. And uh, then I will disassemble this card and I will replace that uh, thermal paste. So we will see uh, differences between all three stages. And also we will uh, see how to change the thermal paste inside the GPU and I think it's time for a first test so I will put this card to the uh, to my test bench and I will uh, run a full mark for some time and then I will uh, check game performance so Later we will uh, compare the results. Okay, so now I will try to get out uh, all dust without uh, disassembling this card. And as you can see, it will be a lot of dust there. Okay, so that's everything what I can take out uh, now and uh, I will go outside and blow uh, some more dust and I will repeat that uh, full mark and uh, metal tests and we will see if there is uh, any change. Ok, 
Okay, so now it's time to disassemble this card and uh, what I will recommend is to have a card preheated so that uh, thermal paste uh, is uh, softer and it's easier to take it apart. And as you can see, we have got dust still inside there, and that uh, thermal parts are completely dried, and thermal compound uh, as well. It's yeah. As you can see, it's breaking. So it's definitely, uh, definitely needs uh, replace. that uh, thicker parts from the power uh, delivery are in uh, good condition still uh, sticky but the memory parts are completely dried also breaking apart so I will have to replace them and as you can see there's uh, still a lot of uh, dust inside Okay, so now I will uh, go outside and clean this and uh, in meantime we'll show you some cl closer look how much dust uh, left inside there.
Okay, so as you can see, I have everything clean. And uh, I already removed that uh, memory thermopad. So I have uh, only GPU to clean now. And uh, never use uh, anything metal for this and usually if it's not uh, that that uh, hard that paste uh, you should use uh, some cloth to clean this Okay, so that's it, and I think it looks much better now. So we can put it back uh, in test bench and check the. Uh, temperatures again so we will see is there any difference after the complete cleaning Ok, 
Okay, so time for uh, some uh, summary. So as you can see, uh, before uh, cleaning we had uh, 73 degree and uh, fan speed uh, on 55% uh, in uh, Fourmart and 70 degree and 49% in uh, Metro. Uh, after just uh, removing the, the old dust from a uh, radiator we dropped to 69 degree and 47 uh, percent in full mark and 66 degree and 42 uh, percent in metro and after replacing thermal paste uh, we had another drop to 67 degree and 44 percent in full mark and 65 degree and 39 percent of fun speed in uh, metro so thanks for watching and if you like this video click the like button don't forget to subscribe to my channel and see you in next video